There you go. <laughs> William, uh, what kept you out of practice yesterday? Yeah, it was just, uh, I think I got food poisoning the day of the game. So uh, just needed some uh, little uh, little rest, a uh, little maintenance. Did you play through the food poisoning? Though? Yeah, I, got, I was puking that day, but yeah, it's whatever. What did you eat that went long? <laughs> uh, I, I think it was sushi for lunch. I, I don't know. I don't think that was the... I'm not, I haven't gone to that restaurant in a long time, and it might have been where I got it. Were you surprised? You, you seemed to play... You looked good in game one? Like, how did you feel, though, as you were going through it? Yeah, I mean, I felt like... I mean, it's game one. you got to be ready. Um, can't let the food poisoning get to you, but uh, it is what it is, and I thought we battled through as a team. We played good. How are you feeling now? Oh, way better, yeah. Today was... Uh, yesterday was a great day. What do you like about the atmosphere? What was it like to play there in game one? I mean, it was just unreal. I mean, getting out there, the towels, the waving, and then the anthem, everybody was into it. Uh, just set the tone for the playoffs. What do you think about Morgan dropping the gloves? Yeah, I mean, uh, he did a great job. I think, I mean, stuff like that might happen. And, I mean, it's playoff hockey. There's not really uh, much else you can do if you need to. Game one might have been the best game the team's played all year. How do you keep that going forward? Um, yeah, I thought we played good. We uh, obviously not going to play a perfect game, maybe like we did the other night, but uh, want to stick to uh, our good habits and stuff like that as uh, as good as we can and the hard work. Does uh, even though you got stopped by Vasilevsky on that breakaway, do you take notes of that help you if you get that chance later in the series, or how do you see it? Yeah, I mean, uh, it, it just comes down to what's like where you're at, how much speed you're like. It's just different, uh, but obviously you made a good save, and yeah, hopefully next time I'll get him. What do you think of David's breakaway goal? Yeah, it was really nice. I think he went in between the arm, and I mean, he put it right, uh, right in the perfect spot to uh, to bury that, and that was a huge goal for the team. What's the confidence level with the team right now? You know, while we're trying not to get too confident, I mean, we know Tampa is a is a great team. I mean, back to back champs. I mean, regardless of what happened last game, that's last game. Now it's uh, game two, and that's where our folks at. What did you make of the way Jake Muzzin played? You know, especially considering all that he's gone through. This yeah. Season? Yeah, no, I mean, he played really hard last night, and, I mean, he's a big boy, and he did a great job for us uh, back there, and it's nice to have him back in the lineup. Obviously, scoring the first goal was uh, huge to get the boys going. A lot gets made of their experience and how that is going to help them, but how would you describe how the hunger of your group uh, fuels you? What do you sense from, from, from your team in that regard? Yeah, I think, uh, I mean, we want to get past uh, first round, and I think that's... Uh, it's a goal of ours, but I mean, at the same time, we're just focused on uh, on game two here. We're not trying to get ahead of ourselves and just be in the moment right now. Well, when you have a, a guy like Muzz who has cup cup experience, how does that help the room? Yeah, I mean, it's huge. I mean, he's been there. He knows what it takes. Um, and I mean, you always look up to a guy like that that has been all the way, uh, all the way. So I mean, just having uh, his advice around the room and stuff in certain situations is huge for the team. How do you think Michael Bunting is going to translate into playoff hockey? I think he'll be great. What does he do to agitate from your perspective the other team? I just think the way he works on pucks and, I mean, gets under the skin, I think, a little bit uh, the way he works and hunts pucks down is uh, the way he gets under the guy's skin. Thanks, guys.